How to Move a Piano Hello and welcome to Video Jug. Pianos are not small instruments like the flute or clarinet. Grand pianos can weigh anywhere from 500 to 1,000 pounds. When moving them a great distance, hire a professional. However, what if you want to simply move your piano from one end of the room to another? Here are some simple steps to save your time and your back. You will need at least two people and piano casters. Step one, check for piano casters. Let's face it, not even Arnold could move a grand piano alone. Having casters or small wheels on the bottom of your piano is necessary to move this massive instrument. When you begin your move, go slowly with one person on each end. Step two, choose a suitable new location. Choose a suitable new location for your piano. Pianos are sensitive to temperature, so don't put it near a window or fireplace. The ideal temperature setting for a piano is 68 degrees. Step three, lower the lid. Position the lid and lock it into place before you start your move. The last thing you want is to have the lid slam down on your hands. Ouch. Step four, teamwork and positioning. The buddy system is crucial when moving a piano. Each person takes an end. Protect the legs of smaller apartment-sized vertical pianos by tilting the piano back ever so slightly. Most of the weight of the piano is in the back. Step five, stay on the inside of the turn. Keep the back of the piano on the inside of the turn. Also, make sure that you are moving your piano endways and not sideways. Otherwise, you are liable to roll the piano over your buddy's foot or break a leg off of your instrument. Step six, protect yourself. Don't bend too far while handling the piano. Always remember to lift with your knees bent and your back straight. Step seven, take your time. Moving a piano is a difficult process and not a race. Slow and steady will win in the end. Step eight, arrival. You did it. Relocating a piano isn't easy, but it looks beautiful in its new spot. Done.